I'm gonna be turning my bed into a secret fish tank. Let me explain. The other day I was scrolling on TikTok and I saw the most insane fish tanks in people's houses. And the first thing I thought was, I need one of these. But in the house we are renting, we are not allowed to have any pets. So I'm gonna put a secret fish tank right here under my bed. And to put it to the test, I'm gonna bring the landlord over and see if he even notices it's there. Wish me luck. Now, with only eight hours to pull this off, I went to ask my best friend, Nick, this. Nick, I have to ask you a Stop. question. You want me to help you turn your bed into a secret fish tank? Yep. So I was doing some research, and these things are way more expensive than I ever imagined. They range anywhere from $1,000 to $100,000. So, I'm gonna have to build one and I think I have the perfect idea. Lucky for me, I turned my bed into a swimming pool not too long ago, and I just realized that this would make the perfect fish tank. The only problem is we took this entire bed apart, so now we're gonna have to put the entire thing back together. I can't believe we're about to do this again. I know. Oh God. Uh, I'm so strong. No. And after spending about 30 minutes clearing out the room. That was way better than that. Why don't we just put tarps and flood the room? We're not doing that. We're not doing that. Now it was time to rebuild the bed frame. This time we need to write the first time, right? Yeah, I don't see any realm where we don't get We got a problem. I thought we said no problems, Drew. I know. I have no idea which holes these went into. I don't even know what's the top or the bottom. So after figuring out which pieces went where, it was finally time to start drilling it all together. Call me Bob the Builder. Hey, Bob the Builder. Thanks. You're welcome. And after around 20 minutes, the bed frame was done. Not bad. Perfect. And nothing went wrong. And after getting the whole frame built, it was time to move the aquarium into the bed frame. <laughs> All right, it's a tiny problem. The aquarium will not fit through that door. We're gonna take it around the house and try to bring it through this other door here. From the hands of a god, I hear my monolith. Born in the heart of the fire, rose out of it. So it started to break in a couple different places. So now we're gonna have to hopefully fix this. Which is so crazy. I guess it's time to try to fill this thing with water. Don't ever smell a shower hose. <laughs> <laughs> there it is. Oh man, I really hope this thing doesn't tear and go everywhere. Sometimes these videos can get very stressful and take a toll on my mental health. But it makes it all worth it to me when I post these videos and I see how much you guys love them. The only thing I'm worried about is this valve right here. We won't know if this thing's gonna leak or not until the water gets past that valve. Now, if you're personally struggling with your mental health, BetterHelp is the best way to find a therapist for you. All right, it's about to pass the valve now. BetterHelp is affordable and accessible from literally anywhere in the world. So if for some reason you don't fit with your therapist, you can switch to a new one at no extra cost. There it goes. I'm not seeing anything. Taking care of your mental health is extremely important. So if you want to improve your life, I truly recommend BetterHelp for online therapy. It's looking like it might work. You can click the link in my description to get 10% off your first month. And a big thanks to BetterHelp for sponsoring this video. It's almost halfway full. True. I am so happy I wasn't here last time because this is a stupid idea. Oh my. Trust the process. And after around an hour, the fish tank was finally filled with water. Holy cow. Now I guess it's time we turn it into a fish tank. So I went on Amazon and found a whole bunch of things I can put inside of this fish tank. So the first thing I obviously need is a fish. But since I'm way too irresponsible to take care of a real fish, I am going to get these electric ones. I also told myself if I ever got a fish tank, I would fill it with the entire bikini bottom. So that's exactly what I'm going to do. Typing anything? No, I'm not. <laughs> yeah, I was gonna say, that's the longest word I've ever heard. <laughs> so, after ordering every part of Bikini Bottom and paying extra for same day delivery, I went to a real aquarium store to pick up the rest of the supplies I needed that I couldn't find online. We'll get some of these rocks and put them inside there. This is heavy. $200 in rocks. Wow. Oh. All right, we got the rocks. Now we need plants and lights. 
$250. Wow. We're deep on this video. By the time we got back from the aquarium stores, Amazon delivered the rest of the supplies we needed. Oh my God. So after getting everything we needed and unboxing our packages, it was time to turn this aquarium into a real fish tank because the landlord was going to be showing up in three hours. Oh. The landlord doesn't see that. Actually, so fun. Oh, that's cool. Here's the big question: Where do I make bikini bottom? Oh, Fish. This looks like a real fish tank. Now, as crazy as this was to see this enormous fish tank come to life, it ended up taking way longer than I thought because before I knew it, we had one hour until the landlord arrived. All right. The only thing I'm left to do is, is swim in it. It's been my life's dream to see bikini bottom in the water. All right. <laughs> Bottle about to make it rain. Let me give you something that'll celebrate. Come on. How crazy does this look? Bro, it looks like you're a giant fish in an aquarium too small for <laughs> I just feel so good. 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 Oh, I just feel so good. 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 Oh, I just feel so good. 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 I just feel so good. <laughs> Everything. <laughs> All right. We have around 45 minutes until the landlord shows up. And I'm still soaking wet. So now we gotta put this room back together. Make it look like a bed. So we covered up the entire fish tank with blankets and pillows and made it look like a real bed. Oh. The room is back together. It's time to see what it looks like. Hit it. Yo. <laughs> Crazy looking. Bro, I haven't seen it yet. What's it look like? Bro, you do not understand what I'm looking at right now. <laughs> Bro, <laughs> we did it! That looks so sick. Tell me this doesn't look like one of those crazy ones you see online and you're like, I wish I had that. It took a water bed to a whole new level. <laughs> yeah. So the landlord is gonna be walking through the entire house to make sure everything is good so we can renew our lease. So hopefully he doesn't notice anything too out of the ordinary, like a fish tank under the bed. Okay, the landlord just parked now. My heart was racing as a landlord was walking, examining every fine detail. It's like some smudging on the walls there. But I'm literally putting my house on the line for you guys, so it would mean a lot if you would hit that subscribe button. Good day. How are you? And finally, this was the moment I had been waiting for. It was time to go into the room and see if he notices my secret fish tank. Um, wow. I honestly didn't think it would be that easy. I just feel so good. So I just successfully built a fish tank under my bed without my landlord noticing. I just really hope he doesn't watch this video. Oh well. Comment down below what I should build next.